right, everybody. Welcome to class tonight. My name is Teacher Chad. This hour, we are going to be uh, practicing our reading and pronunciation. Um, this is a class for beginning and intermediate students. Okay, it's very similar to my advanced reading class, uh, but the stories are a bit sh the the stories are a bit shorter. There we go, and uh, the uh, the words are are less complex. Okay, uh, very good. So the uh, the link to the website we're going to be taking a look at is in the Verbling chat box right now, as well as the Google chat. Now, during the class, I will not be in, um, I will not be in Verbling chat because it does not work properly for me. It doesn't update automatically. So I will uh, mainly be in uh, Google chat. So if you need to write a message or whatnot, um, uh, uh, go ahead and, and write it in there and I'll try and, uh, I'll try and pay attention to what's going on in that chat box. All right, very good. So let's see who we have in class so far. Hi there, Victor. How are you doing? Hello. Good morning. Hello, Jeff. Thank you. <laughs> How do you do? I'm doing great. Thank you. Um, let's see. Trang, welcome back to class. Yes, nice to see you again. Nice to see you as well. And let's see. Amparo, welcome back. Thank you, teacher. All right. I saw uh, just as I was leaving. I saw you put a uh, pronunciation there of the uh, of that mm -hmm. word. What was the yeah. pronunciation of it? Hydrangea. Hydrangea. Something yeah. like that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I I guess so. I I think I it's it's been a while since I've heard that word. I looked at it and I was like, man, I know that's a flower. I just can't remember the exact pronunciation. Maybe so. If that's mm -hmm. if that's what they say, then uh, then that's right. So. And my mom, my mom would be able to to say it right off the bat. You're like, oh yeah, it's this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but look at this in, in this dictionary. Uh huh. You can uh, listen the the pronunciation. Better than mine. <laughs> uh, let's see here. Oh, okay. Hydrangea or hydrangea. Oh, hydrangea. Mm -hmm. Uh, that makes sense. Hydrangea or hydrangea. Mm -hmm. No, I think it's hydrangea. I think that's how most people would say that, hydrangea. Two ways to pronounce it. Hydrangea. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. So shrub, yeah, with the sh yeah with the clusters of flowers. Okay, all right. Okay, cool. Mm -hmm. Great, great, nice. Thank you. All right, let's see who else we have here. Um, we've got Laszlo that came in. How you doing, Laszlo? Hi, Chad. How are you? Hi, good, good morning. Good evening. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. I'm doing great. Thank you. How about yourself, Laszlo? I'm fine. Thank you. Awesome. Okay, how about uh, Joy? Hi there, Joy. Welcome Hi, back. Hi, Thank you. Excellent. And we also have James. How you doing, James? James, are you there? Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and get rolling. Okay, let's see. All right, yeah. Now we'll we'll probably go Hello. through about. Oh, hey James. Hi, teacher. Hi. Good to have you here. Hi. All right, very good. So uh, these these stories are are fairly short, you guys. Uh, so we'll probably go through about eight. Eight or so in uh, in one in one sitting. Okay, we're going to start off on uh, on story number ten. Provider uh, uh, provider overbills uh, customer. Okay. All right, and we're starting off with um, Victor. Okay. Uh, Victor, go ahead and read this first paragraph, and read uh, read down to um, his electric company, please. Simon got a monthly bill that he didn't like. His internet service provider, Wink, automatically withdrew $15 from his checking account each month. This was called direct payment. It made things simpler for him because it meant one less check to write each month. In fact, Simon had direct payments with his gas company, his phone company, and his electric company. Okay, nice job. Okay, let's go to the word electric. 
Uh, make sure to pronounce that T-R here like a C-H-R. Electric. Ele electric. Good, good. Nice job. Okay, let's go to the word uh, fact. Instead of fa, fact, it's fa, fact. Fact. In fact. Good. Yeah, in fact. Nice. Good job. This word here, instead of pi, payment, it's pay. Long A sound, payment. Payment. Okay, very good. Um, and our last word is the word monthly. 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 Good. One more time. Monthly. Mon monthly. Okay, very good. Whoops. Dang it. What happened? It's in my mouse. My mouse just has a mind of its own every once in a while. Okay. <laughs> All right, very good. Thank you. Uh, let's go to Trang. Okay, Trang, uh, let me have you read from, so that was four fewer checks. Okay. And read down to here where it says, make that switch, please. So that was four fewer checks that he had to write each month. This month, instead of fifteen dollars, Wink had with withdraw a uh, seventy-five dollars. Simon went online and looked at his account. Part of the increase was because he had switched from a slow dial-up collection to a fast. DSL connection. Wing charged him $45 just to make that switch. Okay, very good. Very good. Okay, uh, let's go to the word connection. Connection. Collection. Okay, one more time. Conne connection. 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 Okay, now, there you go. Good. Yeah, you need that, that K sound there. Connect. Okay. Connection. Good. Let's go to the word. Uh, let's go to the word switched. Okay. A short I here instead of swe switched. It's swi switched. Switched. Good. Good. All right. Uh, next word here is um, uh, the name uh, Simon instead of Simon. It's Simon. Simon. Okay. Very nice. Uh, next up is withdrawn. Withdrawn. With the with the drawn. Dr, with dr, drawn with drawn. With the drawn. Okay, one more time. With drawn. With the drawn. Okay, all right, better. Um, and our last word here is checks. Okay, give me a good C H sound here. Checks. Checks. Okay, good, good, nice job. Thank you. All right, let's see here. Um, next up is Laszlo. Okay. Okay, Laszlo, please read from Simon Thought. Okay, and I'll have you read down to um, here, uh, but not both, please. Okay, Simon thought that this ch charge itself was ridiculous. It probably took them about five seconds to make the switch, but any time corporation can gouge you, they will. In addition to the $45 we had charged him $50 for his dial-up account, but had also charged him Fifty dollars from his DSL account. This was a double charge since a computer uses dial-up for DSL, but not both. Okay, nice job. All right, let's go to uh, let's go to the word both here instead of both. It's bow both both. Okay, very good. Uh, next up, we have the word. For his, for his, for his. Okay, nice job. All right, now this word here is fifteen instead of fifty. It's fifteen. Fifteen. Good. One more time. Fifteen. Fifteen. 
Okay, good. Next up is charged. 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 Okay, nice job. That was really good. Okay, uh, here uh, we need to say uh, a corporation. A corporation. Try that. A corporation. Good. And our last word is ridiculous. Ridiculous. Uh, ri ridiculous. Okay, ridicu. Ridiculous. Mm -hmm. Ridic uh, rid ridiculous. Okay, good. One more time. Now uh, try a good R sound there instead of ri ri. It's ri ridiculous. Ridiculous. Okay. All right. Better. Nice job. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Let's go to uh, Joy. Yes. Uh, Joy, please read this uh, this last sentence, and then I'll have you continue on the next story. Okay. We'll see about this. Simon thought as he researched for Wings 800 number. Okay, good. Um, now, instead of researched, the word is searched. As he searched for. Try that. See, sure. As he searched. As he searched for. Try that one more time. As he searched for. Okay. Now, instead of saying searched, it's searched. One more time. Searched. Okay, okay. Searched. Good. That's it. That's it. Nice job. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's go to our next story, you guys. Just press mm -hmm. the arrows down below. We're going to story number 11. All right, and Joy, please read the first paragraph. Okay, and let me have you read till, uh, till he, turned, he turned on the heat, please. Gordon was hungry. He opened the refrigerator. There must be something in here to eat. He thought... There was a single hot dog. He took it out of, out of his package and put a small flying pan, pan on the stove's gas burner. He turned on the heat. Okay, nice job. Okay. Um, all right, let's go to the word put. Instead of poo, put, it's pu, put. Put. All right, very nice. And our last word here is refrigerator. 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 Okay. All right. So our stress is here. Refri. Refrigerator. Dum bum ba da dum. Refrigerator. Refrigerator. Good. One more time. Refrigerator. Refrigerator. All right. Good. Good. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you, Kishan. Sure. No problem. Uh, let's go to. Amparo, Amparo, mm -hmm. please read from. Then he poured. Okay, uh, finish this uh, this paragraph here, okay. and let me have you read to uh, till wheat sprouted wheat. Then he poured a little bit of vegetable oil into the pan. He sliced the hot dog in half lengthwise. When the oil got hot, he put the two halves in the pan. About a minute later, he whipped, he flipped each hat over. After another minute, he took the hot dog out of the pan. Gordon put uh, two slices of bread into the toaster. This was tasty and healthy, unhealthy bread. The first ingredient listed was organic sprout with wheat. Okay, uh, one more time, try that uh, we, wheat. Wheat. Okay, very good. Um, all right, let's go to uh, Gordon right here. Gore, Gordon. Gordon. Okay, nice. Uh, next, we have the word flipped, short I, flipped. Flipped. Okay, good. Um, this word here is halves, halves. Halves. Yeah, so that L is silent, halves. Okay. Mm, okay. Um, and our last word here is uh, sliced instead of sliced. Okay, use an unvoiced S. Sliced. Sliced. Good, good, nice job. Now, I, I think this is interesting because he's talking about tasty and healthy bread <laughs> and adding orga organic uh, sprouted wheat while using a hot dog. Okay, 
<laughs> cooked in uh, what did he put? Vegetable oil. Okay. Yeah, super healthy, dude. <laughs> Wow, absolutely crazy. Um, okay, let's go to uh, let's go to Victor. Uh, Victor, please read from uh, the first ingredient. Okay, and let me have you finish there and come down to. Uh, let's see here. Go ahead and and read down to the onto the chili bits, please. The first ingredient in ordinary bread is usually unbleached flour. When the toast popped up, he put mustard, mayonnaise, and ketchup on one slice. Then he added two slice so slices of onion. On top of the onions, he placed the hot dog. On top of the hot dog, he put a couple of slices of apple. Then he added add some bits of hot green chili, and then put the top piece of toast onto the chili bits. Okay, the sandwich sounds gross. <laughs> he, he added he added apple. Uh, I don't know. You might think that sounds delicious, but apple and hot dog, no. Um, okay, <laughs> let's go to this word here. The word is bits instead of beets. Bits. Oh, bits. Okay, good. Uh, let's go to slices of apple. Apple, slices of apple. Slice, of, slice, slice of apple. Okay, slices, slices Slice. of apple. Slices of apple. There you go. Good. Um, now, uh, the word onion. Okay, instead of saying onion, okay, it's onion. 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 Good. One more time. Onion. Onion. Good. Uh, next up is put instead of put. Okay, put, put. Put. All right, very good. And our last word here is flour. Instead of flour, it's flour, flour. Flour. Yep, just like uh, the uh, plant that grows outside, flour. Okay. Good. All right, nice job. Thank you, Victor. Thank you, Victor. Okay, let's go to Trang. Trunk, go ahead and read this last uh, sentence here, and I'll have you uh, um, continue on uh, to our next story, please. Ah, oh, what a sandwich, he thought, as he sat down to eat. Okay, good. Nice pronunciations. Very good. Okay, let's go to our next uh, next story here, Trunk. Okay, continue here at uh, She Needed. Okay, finish the, finish the uh, paragraph here. And move down to... Read down to Weren't Agreeing With Her, please. Sarah needed to see the doctor. She had an upset stomach. She felt bloated and she needed to pass gas every minute also. It was terrible. She couldn't go anywhere in public. Her friends told her it was because she had moved to America. The air, water, and food in America weren't agreeing with her. Okay, all right, very good. All right, let's go to agreeing. Okay, so nice and smooth with those vowels. Agreeing. Agreeing. Okay, instead of uh, it's uh. Agreeing. Agreeing. Okay, very good. Um, let's go to the word America. All right, give me a good R sound here instead of America. Ameri America. America. Okay, one more time. America. America. Okay, very good. Uh, next, we have the word told. Make sure to pronounce the L sound there. Toll, told. Told. Okay, told. One more. okay good, good. Uh, next up, we have the word minute. Okay, this is a short I sound. Instead of me, minute, it's me, minute. Minute. 
Okay. All right. One more time. Use the short I. Okay. Excuse me. You're saying me, minute. Okay. Instead of me, it's me, me, min, minute. Minute. There you go. That's it. Okay. Nice job. Uh, next. Uh, sorry, you guys. I've got hiccups. Uh, next up is bloated. Blow. Bloated. Bloated. Mm -hmm. Very good. Uh, next, we have the word stomach. Okay, the CH here creates a K sound. Stomach. Stomach. Okay, one more time. Stomach. Now, that A is going to sound like a short I sound. Stomach. Stomach. And let me. Uh, stomach. Okay. Uh, instead of stomach, okay, we're using a short I for the A. Okay. So that A is going to sound like an I sound. Stomach. 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 There you go. Stomach. 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 Okay. Good. Better. Better. All right. Let's go to the word doctor. So even though the word ends with an O-R, we do not say doctor, okay? It's do doctor, doctor. Doctor. Okay, very good. And our last word here is the word, or is the name, Sarah. Okay, instead of Sara, okay, give me a good English R. Sarah, Sarah. Sarah. Okay, very good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Mm-hmm. All right, let's see here. Um, next up is Laszlo. Yep. Okay, Laszlo, please continue from they said. Okay, uh, finish that paragraph and read this next one till glasses a day, please. Okay. They said she would have to return to her home country. No way, Sarah said she didn't want to go home she likes america this was a minor problem she was was sure any good doctor would solve it in no time two days later she saw her doctor he asked her if she drank milk she said yes three glasses a day okay all right nice job nice pronunciations let's take a look at three words here so first up Okay, this is drink instead of drunk. Okay, dre, drink. Drink. Okay, one more time. Dre, drink. Drink. Okay, good. Uh, next up, we have the word good instead of gu, good. Okay, it's gu, good. Good, good. Okay, excellent. And our last word is, um, okay, right here, return. Return. Give me a good R there. Return. Return. All right. Nice job. Thanks. Nice job. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks, Jim. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see here. Next up is Joy. Yes. Okay, Joy, please read from Don't Drink Anymore. Okay, finish the paragraph and read this next one down to Find Another Boyfriend. Please. Don't Drink Anymore. Right. Regular milk. Start drinking lactose-free milk because lactose can upset your stomach. Then he asked her if there were any big problems in her life. She said that her boyfriend was a big problem. He wanted to get married, but she didn't. The doctor said, that she should find another boyfriend. Okay, very good. Very good. All right, let's go to the word another. Okay, instead of ana, another, it's ana, another. Another, ana, ana, another. Good, good. One more time. Another. Another. Okay, good. Uh, let's go to the word boy. Okay, so this is oi. Boy, boyfriend. Boyfriend. Okay, one more time. So, boyfriend. The stress is going to go on boy instead of friend. Okay, it's boyfriend. Boyfriend. Okay, very nice. And our last word here is regu. 
regular, regular. Re re regular. Okay, yeah, and so instead of a uh, AR sound, lar, it's mm -hmm. lur, okay? Lur. Regular. Regular. Okay, one more time, regular. Regular. All right, good, good. Okay, nice job, thank you. Thank you, teacher. No problem, let's go to Amparo. Amparo, let me have you uh, finish off our story, reading okay. from a Y okay. down to the end, and I'll have you continue on the next story, please. Why, Sarah asked. Because your boyfriend is giving you too much stress. He's probably the main cause of your upset stomach. I don't think my boyfriend is going to like that. Just telling, just telling me if he really loves you, he should leave you. All right, interesting. Okay, <laughs> uh, let's uh, let's see here. Let's practice the word Sarah instead of Sarah. 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 All right, good. Yeah, everything else is just fine. Okay, nice. Let's go to our our next little bit here. Okay, we're on uh, uh, story 13, you guys, and Kali, a bunch of other one-liners. Um, let me have you read from uh, the beginning here on Fado down mm -hmm. to, uh, let's see, um, another for granted, please. Jill answered the phone. It was Jack. Jill, would you marry me next week? What? Jack repeated his question. Of course not, she replied. She wondered why he was asking her that question. They had already agreed that when people get married, they immediately start to take each other for granted. Okay. All right. Good. All right. Let's go to the word each other instead of each other. Each other. Each other. Each other. There you go. Good. Um, next up is repeated. Give me a good repeated. ED ending. Uh -huh. One more time. Repeated. Repeated. Okay, very good. And our last word is the name Jill, short I. Jill. 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 Good, good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's go to Victor. Okay. All right, Victor, please continue from they don't, uh, they don't do. Okay, finish the paragraph. And I'll have you read down to here where it says they were special. They don't do the little things, like opening the car door or holding hands. They get too comfortable. They treat their partner like an old shoe. And eventually, they get bored with each other and get divorced. We already agree that we don't want to get married because we don't want to get divorced. Jack agreed, but he argued, argued that they were special. Okay, nice job. All right, let's go to the word special instead of spa spatial. Okay, use the short E sound. Spe special. Special. Okay, very good. Um, nice correction on argued. Okay, that was good. Let's go to the name Jack instead of ja Jock. Okay, it's ja Jack. Jack. Okay, very good. Um, next up is... Um, comfortable. Okay. Now, yeah. So here you said comfta, comfortable, comfta. It's comfter, comfortable. Comfortable. Okay, one more time. Comfter, comfortable. Comfortable. There you go. There you go. Good. All right. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. All right. And we went to special. Yeah. Okay. Okay, let's go to Trang. All right, Trang, let me have you uh, continue here from They Were Different. Okay, and let me have you go ahead and end this story here. So They Were Different down to the end. They were different from other couples. They loved each other too much to end up in a divorce. Yes, that may be true, but still, why next week? Why can't we think about it for another year or two? Because I had two dreams the last two nights. In both dreams, you let me for another man. 
In fact, you let me for two different men. I want to get married so now so I don't have these dreams anymore. Hmm. What does this man look like? <laughs> okay, very good. Uh, that's a funny funny ending. Okay. Uh, good, let's go to the word these. Give me a voiced S sound here. Okay, these. These. Okay, very good. Um, next up is um, nights, right here. So uh, a T sound, then an S, okay? Nights. Nights. Good, that's it, that's it, nice. Um, let's go to the word divorce. Okay, so instead of divorce, it's d divorce. Divorce. Okay, good, and our last word here is different. Okay, short I sound instead of different, D, D, it's D, different. Different. Okay, one more time, different. Different. Okay, all right, nice job, nice job, thank you. All right, you guys, let's go to our next story. Okay, this is story number 14, Laundry Day. And I'll have Laszlo continue. Uh, please read the first paragraph. And let's see, I'll have you read down to uh, that needed washing, please. Uh, needed. Okay. Saturday morning meant one thing for Suzanne doing the laundry. She hated doing the laundry. Anne and who siastically she took the pillow cases of all the pillows. Thus she removed the fitted sheet from the mat mattress. Uh, she took the towel of the towel bar in the bathroom. She grabbed a couple of dirty dish towel out of the kitchen and looked all around her apartment for anything else that needed washing. Okay, nice job, nice job. All right, let's go to the word towels instead of towels. Okay, the word is towels. Towels. Okay, very good. Next up, we have the word uh, took instead of to took. It's to took. Took. Okay, very nice. Um, next, we have uh, the word cases. All right. All right, instead cases. of case, cases, it's cases. Cases. Okay, very nice. Um, let's see, our next one is this big one. You were very yeah. close on this word, <laughs> right? Very close, okay? Unenthusiastically, unenthusiastically. Unenthusiastically. Uh, unenthusiastically. Yeah, good, one more time. Unenthusiastically. Unenthusiastically. Okay, excellent, excellent. Um, let's go to the word hated instead of hated. Okay, hey, hated. Hated. Okay, very nice. And our last word here is meant instead of meant. Okay, me, short e, meant. Meant. Awesome. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's see here. All right, next up is uh, Joy. Yes. Okay, Joy, let me have you continue from uh, in in the corner. Okay, finish that paragraph. And I'll have you read down to dryer for 40 minutes. In the corner of her living room, a can of coins sat on top of the file ca cabinet. She fetched out seven quarters. She opened the cabinet under her kitchen sink and grabbed a plastic bottle of liquid detergent. Finally, she set her electronic timer for thir 35 minutes. The timer would remind her that the washing was done. 
and that it was time to go back downstairs and put the clothes into the dryer for 40 minutes. Okay, very good. Very good. All right, let's go to, let's see here. We're going to go to the word dryer. Okay, instead dryer. of dryer, dryer, it's dryer. Curve your tongue up to pronounce that R sound. Dryer. Dryer. Okay, one more time. Dryer. 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 Good, that's it. That's it. Nice. <laughs> um, let's, let's go to the word um, remind. Okay, long I sound. I, I, my, mind, remind. Remind. Good, good. Okay. Um, up here in the second or in the first paragraph, this is fished. Okay, with the T, fished. Fished. Okay, very good. And our last word is corner. Okay, O R sound. Core, corner, core, corner. Corner. Okay, one more time. Core, corner. Core. Corner. All right, very good. Very good. Thank you. Thank you, Tisha. Sure, no problem. All right, let's go to um, Amparo. Yep. And Amparo, let me have you finish up the story, reading from without time, without the timer, down to the end, please. Without the timer, Susan would completely forget to check her clothes. Susan carried the laundry basket downstairs. How happy she would be when her laundry was done for this week. As she approached the laundry room, she heard a familiar sound. The sound was the washer washing and the dryer drying. One of her neighbors had got there before her. Mother and Susan took her basket back upstairs. <laughs> Very good. So she wasn't able to wash her clothes after all. All right. Okay, let's go to muttering. So switch the double T to a D there. Muttering. 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 Okay, instead of mother, mud. Think of that R sound. Mud. Muttering. Muttering. Okay, one more time. Mud. D mud. 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 There you go. There you go. Muttering. Muttering. Okay, good. Uh, next up is um, uh, weak. Long E sound. Weak. Week. Okay, very good. And our last word here is laundry. Instead of loan, laundry, la, lawn, laundry. Laundry. Okay, one more time. Laundry. Laundry. Okay, excellent. All right, nice job. Thank you. Okay, you guys, let's go to our next story. This is story number 15, A Noisy Neighbor. Okay. Victor, let me have you read this first paragraph and read down to here where it says note, please. Okay. Barbara couldn't take it anymore. Her upstairs neighbor was blasting his stereo again. She had asked him twice already to turn the volume down. The first time she asked, he was surprised. He said he didn't know that she could hear his stereo. Yes, she said. It's just like your stereo was in my living room. I can hear every note. Okay, good, good. Uh, all right, let's go to the word surprised. Sir, surprised. Surprised. Okay, all right, excellent. Uh, next up is the word her. Okay, instead of hear. Okay, her. Her. Okay, one more time. Her. Her. Good. All right. Now remember the L is silent in the word could, couldn't, yeah, couldn't, <laughs> couldn't. Okay, very nice. And our last word is the name here. This is Barbara. Okay, give me good R's here. Barbara. Barbara. Okay, very good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you, Chuck. Sure, no problem. All right, let's go to Chang. You are up next. Please read from he he said he would. Okay, and I'll have you read till uh, till here where it says he said he would try. Please. He's <coughs> he 
he said he would keep it down. She hoped that he was telling the truth. Of course, he wasn't. The very next day, he blasted his terrier. She, she marched upstairs to remind him of his promise. He said the volume was so loud that he could barely hear it. She asked him to turn it lower. He said he would try. Okay, very good. All right, let's go to the word um, could. Okay, instead of ku, could. All right, the word is ku, could. Quad. Okay, instead of quad, it's ku, could. One vowel sound here. Could. Good. Good. Okay. There you go, one more time. Could. Could. All right, very good. Um, next up is the word low. Okay, only an O sound here instead of low. Okay, it's low. Low. All right, very good. Okay. Um, next up we have the word him. Instead of him, using an E sound, he, it's he, him. 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 All right, very good. Uh, next up is very. Okay, give me a good R sound instead of very. Very, it's ver, very. Very. All right, very good. Okay, here is the word course. Okay, start off with that O sound. Move to the R. Co, core, course, course. Girl, course. Yeah. So uh, forget that that U is there. Okay, the U doesn't do anything. Okay, it's core, course. Course. Okay, let's give it one more try. Core, course. Core, course. There you go. All right, nice job. And um, one last, um, one last little bit here. Okay, we're gonna try keep it down. Now we're focusing on the word it. Okay. So after keep, after you say eep, you want to say it. Instead of eep, eat, it's keep it down. Keep it down. Try that. Keep it down. Okay, good. Good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, let's go to Laszlo. Yep. Uh, please read from Barbara Could Swear. Okay, finish the paragraph. And I'll have you read to uh, here where it says, keep it down, please. Okay. Barbara could swear that when she rent rented her apartment, the, last, uh, the music was louder, louder uh, than when she had walked upstairs. So this was the third time she took her baseball bat upstairs with her. She knocked very loudly on on his door. When he opened the door, she screamed at him li like a crazy person. She told him she would kill him if he didn't turn the music down and keep it down. Okay. All right. Yep. She seems crazy. Um, let's go to the word down instead of don it's dow down down okay one more time down down okay very good um, next up is the word uh, told right here give me that L sound told 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 okay very good um, next up is loud loudly 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 Okay, one more time. Loudly. Loudly. Good, good. And let's go to the word uh, with right here. With, give me a good th. With. With. Okay, instead of we, with, it's short i. With. With. There you go. Okay, um, let's go to. Uh, uh, oh, up here. Okay, louder. Instead of luder, it's lau. Louder louder 
Okay, very nice. And our last word here is re-entered. 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 Uh, re good, good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. uh, all right, let's go to Joy. Yes. Joy, please uh, read from His Eyes Got Big and, uh, and finish up the story, please. I'll have you continue on to the next story. Mm -hmm. His eyes got big. She went back downstairs. She couldn't hear a note. I can't believe I said that, she told herself. Okay, good. Um, let's go to the word note instead of nut. Okay, it's no, note. Note. Okay, good. And let's practice downstairs. Okay, this is a long, long A. A, stair, stairs. Downstairs. Downstairs. Okay, curve that tongue up for the R. Stair. Downstairs. Downs. Downstairs. Good, good. All right, nice job. Okay, let's go to our next story. This is story number 16, New Realtor. And let me have you uh, read this first paragraph, Joy. Okay, mm -hmm. and read down to here where it says, The instructor said. Norma was this correct. She was a new realtor. She had recently passed the sta state test on her first try. Then she joined her real realty company. They offered training classes two or four times a week. Norma attended the classes faithfully but because English was her second language, she didn't catch everything that the instructor instructor said. Okay. All right, let's go to the word said instead of said. Okay. Give me a short E sound. Se, said. Said. Okay, one more time. Se, said. Said. Okay, good. Um, next up, we have the word second. Instead of second, second. Second. All right, nice job. Okay, uh, next up is the word faithfully. 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 Okay, give me a long A sound. A, fa, faith, faithfully. Faithfully. There you faithfully. go. Faithfully. There you go, good. And our last word here is for, okay? Fo, for, for. For. Okay, curve that tongue up for the uh, the R sound. For. For. Okay, go to that O first. For, for. 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 Good. For, okay? For. Good. All right. Nice job. Thank you. Thank you, Tisha. All righty. Let's see here. Let's go to um, Amparo. Oh, yeah. Amparo's next. Joy, you just went, right? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, Amparo, let me have you uh, read from when she asked. Okay. Uh, finish the paragraph. And read down till... Uh, he would say, please. When she asked uh, the instructor to repeat something, he told her to see him after class. But when other students asked a question, the instructor answered the question right then and there. To Norma, the instructor always said, see me after class. Then when she tried to see him after class, he would say that he was late for an appointment. How about how about next time, he would say. Wow, what a jerk. <laughs> a what a jerk. <laughs> okay, uh, one word here. Repeat. Repeat. Okay, one more time. Repeat. Repeat. Good, good. Yeah, everything else is nice. Okay, good job. Thank you. Yeah, this dude's a jerk. Man. All right, let's go to Victor. Okay. All right, Victor, please read from uh, He Was Always Too Busy. 
And let me have you read down to, um, you know what? Go ahead and, and finish, the, finish the paragraph or finish the story, please. Mm -hmm. He was always too busy to help her. He's not too busy. He's just too lazy, her boyfriend said. There are too many instructors like that. All they care about is presenting their information. If the students don't get it, that's their problem. You have to be strong. These people are not going to help you. They want you to fail, because that means less competition for them. It's a dog eat dog business. Okay, good. Uh, let's try that uh, that phrase one more time. Dog eat dog. Dog eat dog business. Dog eat dog business. Okay, make sure to pronounce that T. Okay, dog eat. Dog eat dog. Dog eat dog business. Okay, good. Uh, next up is uh, presenting. Okay, so stress here. Instead of uh, uh, presenting, it's presenting. All they care about is presenting their information. Presenting. Okay, very nice. And our last word here is busy. Short I sound instead of be busy. 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 Good. All right, nice job. Thank you. Thank you, teacher. All righty. Okay, let's go to number 17. And Trong, let me have you continue, please. How come that happened? Sorry, guys. You have the light right in the camera. Okay. Um, all right. So, Trog, let me have you read from uh, Jennifer's ears. Okay. Uh, finish the paragraph and read down to alarm went off, please. Jennifer's ears were talking to her. They were making little sounds like little bubbles bursting. A bubble was bursting almost every second. It was not painful but annoying. She knew the cows. While she was cleaning the whiteboard after her class ended last night, the fire alarm went off. Okay, very good. All right, let's go to the word fire. 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 Okay, good. Much better with that er sound. Okay, uh, this word here is pronounced while. 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 Okay, curve your tongue up to pronounce that L. While. While. Okay, almost. So let's let's try this. We're gonna say, uh. Try that. Curve that tongue up, and we're just gonna say the L sound. Uh. 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 Okay, uh. now, uh, what you're saying there is you're, you are pronouncing an R. You're saying er, okay? The L, when you pronounce the L, you need to touch the top of your, uh, touch the tip of your tongue to the top of your mouth. Okay? Uh, uh, uh. It goes up right here. Uh. Uh, uh. Okay? Uh, bring it closer to your teeth, okay? It's uh, going to be uh. right up here. Uh. Uh. Uh, Instead uh, of ah, uh, yeah. if you push it back, ah, uh, that's not correct. It needs to be up close to your teeth. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, if you have it, if you have it back, ah, uh, okay, that's not the right sound. So it's closer to the teeth. Uh, 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 okay, uh, almost. Uh, 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 okay, so let's try uh, this. We're gonna say while. Wire. While. Wire. 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 Okay, Wire. Wire. Okay. Wire. All right, you're almost there. Now, um, uh, what what I would do if I were you it, uh, with the uh, the L sound, okay? Um, practice in the mirror, okay? On the side, okay? If your tongue is forced back, uh, like that, that's incorrect. Push it closer to your teeth. Uh, okay, and it's uh, going to be a voice sound. Uh, okay, meaning uh, that you should uh, have a vibration here. Uh, uh, 
while, uh, while, uh, and it's going to be an uh, 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 sound. Why? Uh, okay, uh, so, yeah, why, uh. Why, uh. Okay, with why, an uh. uh Okay, almost. So we'll we'll keep working on that L sound. So it's tongue position, but then also activating uh, your your throat, okay, and your vocal cords, and saying that O oh sound. Okay. Yes. All right. Very good. Okay, you guys. Well, we are just about out of time. Thank you for for coming to class today or tonight. It was great to have you here. Um, I will be uh, taking a break and uh, coming back tomorrow morning. Okay. All right, guys. Thank you very much. Thank we'll see you. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank, Thank you very much.